You welcome to TBP TV News. This news is probably brought to you by Lee Satellite and Training. My name is Jamila Tuisa Vanderpool. In the headlines: Pastor jailed 519 years for defrauding over 100 people. New bond under domestic debt exchange program potentially worthless. Senior host is said. Kenya's president alleges plot to kill electoral chief in last poll. Now, the news in detail. The Accra High Court has sentenced the chief executive officer of Iswa Career Link Marketing Company Limited, Reverend Edward, to 519 years imprisonment. According to a report by the Chronicle newspaper, Reverend Wabing was handed the sentence on Monday, January 16, 2023, after being found guilty on 173 counts of conspiracy to commit crime and defending by false pretenses. The ruling by the court provided by Evelyn Asamoah brought to an end to three years of trial where 12 witnesses testified against the Reverend Minister. The convict Reverend Asamoah will serve eight years of each of the 173 accounts with the sentences running concurrently. Moving on to our next story, convener of the Ghana Individual Bondholders Forum, Senor Hosi Hasbaf, claims that the rejection of the domestic debt exchange program by the individual bondholders will bring economic hardship to the country and would potentially make their bonds worthless. According to him, data available from Finance Ministry demonstrates that such claims are false and are mainly meant to create a state of fear and panic to get bondholders to sign into the ongoing debt exchange program. Speaking on Joy News, he explained that signing on to debt exchange program would rather make one's bonds potentially worthless and irredeemable. Moving on to our last story, Kenya's president William Ruto has made sensational accusation of a plot to adapt and kill the head of electoral commission in the run to the announcement of the presidential results last year. Mr. Ruto was declared the winner of the presidential election held in August 2022, taking 50.5 of the vote amid dramatic scenes at the Vote Tallinn Center. At the time, Electoral Commission Chairman Wafula Chebugati said he had done his duty despite receiving threats. On Tuesday, the president claimed the plot to adapt Mr. Chebugati was sanctioned by the highest office, according to local media reports. That brings us to the end of the news, a recap of the headlines. Pastor jailed 519 years for defrauding over 100 people. New bonds under domestic debt exchange program potentially worthless, senior host is said. Kenya's president alleges plot to kill electoral commission chief in last polls. This news was proudly brought to you by Lee Satellite and Training. My name is Jamila Tuisa Vanderpoy. Stay tuned.